No one in the history of WWE has done for this company what John Cena has. Not only inside the ring, but outside the ring. The following contest is a submission match. Making his way to the ring from West Newberry, Massachusetts. Weighing in at 251 pounds. Oh, he This. I can't believe the nerve he's got interrupting this matchup. You shouldn't be surprised. Whoa, jump starting the action. That is some unsportsmanlike conduct. Oh, give me a break, Saxton. The ref motioning to get in the ring now. Yeah, I think the referee is at the end of the ring. You can only push a referee so far, Corey. How can he not be impressed by the guts and the toughness of these competitors? I can tell you, it goes against the nature of every single WWE superstar to concede anything to their opponent, Michael. So the idea of submitting is absolutely despicable to each of these competitors, and they will do everything in their power to avoid it. That's very true, but the fact remains that at the end of the day, one of these superstars is going to have to concede. Byron, what do you think will be the factor that determines who wins this submission match? Timing is just as important as strategy. You can know what you want to do, but you have to be able to realize when the right time is to do it. If you see that opening, you can't waste any time. You have to take it immediately, which is why being so well-versed in submissions is an advantage. This kind of match is definitely advantageous for a technical competitor. The commanding presence of Samoa Joe on display. Cena has to find a way to reassert himself. from Joe. Pocket hit. Wow. Oh, man. This has... Oh, no, no, this, no, This no. wasn't planned. He's upset. Look who's marched into the ring. Turn around and go back to the locker room. There's no reason for him to be out here right now. And Cena finds himself on the receiving end. Inverted atomic drop. Incoming. Big and the centaur to cap it off. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. He steps foot in the ring again. Left by the turnbuckles. Yeah. Great wherewithal on the counter. Back and forth from these competitors. Restraints. 
Snap suplex, very effective. He's just getting beaten at all fronts here. These are dire straits for him. He needs to be extra cautious now. If anyone can make a big comeback, you know it's John Cena. Uh-oh, this is gonna be bad. Really bad. won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. How do you get out of this? Oh, look at that. What a great counter. You have to imagine we're hitting the late stages of this matchup. Who's going to dig deeper at this point? It might just take that extra push, that extra inch further to create the difference. He has a right where he wants him. Uh-oh! It's cinched in. Coquina Clutch! Coquina Clutch! This one's over, Byron. Well, this isn't going to win the fall, but it's going to do a lot of damage. And look at him tapping. He's had enough, but it doesn't even matter in this scenario. He slides back into the ring. Cena stays off the attack. Solid punch. Uh-oh, Joe's got the knees crossed and crushed. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Nice counter by Cena. Kick to the midsection, sets it flip. Getting him into the corner. Things went from bad to worse. What is Cena thinking? Wait, wait, wait a minute. No, no way. Cena's thinking about the end. What an A! Cena can end it there. A 
single leg camel clutch and a great counter. Oh, what a tonic drop. Pow! And a senton! Uh oh, there it is! The clutch is in! This is all over. Put a clutch lock in for Samoa Joe. There's a matter of time before he's a tap out. survive and pull through. Some superstars doing what they do best. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, Samoa Joe. Just an unbelievable win here after everything that was thrown at them. Talk about resilience. Talk about endurance. Really, talk about stubbornness. It's